beer, the beer lady did you how did that happen did you see what she was doing oh. no nah, i was i was upset at myself because i had an and one opportunity and i didn't finish the left it short and uh you know my momentum just took me to the sideline and i'm not going to run over our beer lady you know and uh and she had one you know in her hand so i took it out of her hand but not much of a beer guy if she'd have some red wine i probably would have definitely took a sip <laughs> if it was meant to happen it was meant to happen honestly um you know brown wanted to pretend like he was drinking a beer that's on brown <laughs> i don't i don't i don't i don't plan for things like that man i, I remember one time it happened in the moment to a, a Years ago, my first stand in Cleveland, we played in Oklahoma City, and um, I think I was, I think it was my first stand in Cleveland, or maybe been in Miami. I went towards the other end of the basket, went out of bounds, and the little kid was eating French fries, and I took mm -hmm. one of his French fries. I didn't come into the game saying I'm gonna find a kid with some French fries, I'm gonna take it. No, it just happens. It's just kind of spur of the moment, and um, you know, I remember last year, you know, in Atlanta, you know, I was going towards the sideline away from their basket, and it was a. It was a pregnant lady. pregnant lady. It was a pregnant lady sitting right there. And I was like, oh, like we need you and that baby to be healthy. Let me slow down. So you know, it just it just happens. Just I don't know. I don't I don't do it to get a reaction. It just kind of happens. You know, everybody's a part of the game. You guys are a part of the game. The fans are part of the game. People from our concession stands are part of the game. Everybody. So you know, why not feel why not feel welcome? If real quick if I can change gears when